Good morning, guys. So this is gonna be a clean with me living room edition. <laughs> um, this is the room I clean the most by far. My kids mess it up at least three times a day, so I find myself, you know, redoing their bookshelf and their stuffed animals throughout the day. Um, right now they're taking a nap, so I'm gonna go ahead and take advantage of that and get this all straightened up, hopefully before they wake up. So now I'm just kind of putting everything back where it goes on the bookshelf. Um, I'm putting all the stuffed animals in front of their toy box for now. Um, I Because those kind of just go on top of their toy box once I have all their toys in there. I do want to get, I don't know if you guys, I'm sure you've seen those little um, My Zoos, I think they're called, um, on Pinterest and I've seen them on Facebook before. I really want to get one of those made. Um, so I can shove all their stuffed animals in there. <laughs> I made it on the couch. Um, and because when they want to get in their toy box, they first take every single one of their stuffed animals off, throw it on the floor, you know, and then they can get into their toy box. So it's not the best system, but it's what we do for now. You can see that I have my daughter's potty in the living room. Um, I mentioned in a previous video that we are potty training her and this just seems to be the best place where she can make it to the potty the quickest. We do spend a lot of time in our living room. Um, as you can see most of their toys are out here and it's just the most convenient place for us. You never know what you're going to find under their toy box. And I found a chewed up ball from Carter's little ball pit that he got for Christmas. My dog loves to chew up those plastic balls. And there's some toys that were under my couch. <laughs> I have to get the broom, every time I clean the living room, I have to get the broom and sweep underneath my couch because there's about a three inch gap from the bottom of the couch to the floor. And there is blocks. I mean, I just find all kinds of stuff under there. So we start to freeze here in small talk over the summer breeze out of safe songs, finding hidden caves all the Shaped by the ocean waves It's a night to stay up late Things we have to do can wait We've got catching up to do There's a And moving on to the other side of my living room 
I'm just gonna pick up the few clothing items from earlier in the day from the kids. Um, go put those in my laundry hamper and then move the rest of the stuff um, off the couch and put it where it goes. And then I'm gonna be putting some um, fabric powder, like a refreshing powder, um, on my couch and vacuuming that off. So now I'm going to go ahead and sweep up the living room floor, get all the dust off um, and the powder from the couch that got on the floor and just let that powder sit on the couch for a few minutes before I vacuum it off. This is where my son starts waking up and I'm trying to shush him back to sleep. Normally that works um, if I just hush to him for a couple seconds and he will go right back to sleep. He was trying to wake up here, but I did get him to go back to sleep for just a couple more minutes. And here comes my husband home from work, just in time because Carter was just starting to wake up at this point. Um, so David was able to take him out of his seat and take him for a little bit so I could finish filming.
now just gonna fluff all the pillows, pull the cushions out, and throw my throw pillows back on there. And last thing to do is wipe down my table real fast. I use Mrs. Meyers cleaning products uh, pretty much throughout my entire house. Here's the final product. Um, I'm really liking the lavender scent and I have also love the peony. That's probably my favorite. But sorry it's a little blurry. I had to hurry up and get the after shot before my husband came back out of the room with Carter because this did not last long. Five minutes later. Carter Dean! What are you doing? Mommy just cleaned that up. Carter? Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next one.